super strong guys super strong i'm glad you're trying it good job guys Whew. all right it's gonna be hot guys we're gonna start standing today we're gonna start with the active vinyasa style warm-up so we can sweat out of our mind and let's reach all the way up all the way through big breaths exhalation all the way forward fold take your head down relax your neck reach halfway through and go to your chair pose all the way all the way big reach big sweep hips forward hard up and all the way forward fold back and guys stay in your forward fold i'm gonna make it a little bit noise and not as loud it's actually loud i think so then slowly look halfway through and back to your chair pose reach all the way up big breath big sweep hips forward heart up we're gonna go ahead and step to the first plank or hop to the first plank see how you can do it push down chaturanga all the way reach up and downward facing dog all the way through relax your neck drop the head look forward we're gonna do it one more time rock on your toes jump or hop or step forward chair pose big breath big sweep hips forward hard up all the way and forward fold guys step walk or hop push down chaturanga do your best come on up reach up up dog supported or not take it back downward facing dog look halfway through bend your knees step walk hop chair pose all the way big sweat big sweep hips forward chest up all the way forward hop fold one more time step walk or hop push down guys chaturanga dandasana reach up downward facing dog look underneath the right take your right leg up open it up step forward to your lunge guys reach up and open all the way step to your chair pose stay strong big sweep hips forward chest up all right forward fold step walk or hop we're practicing today a lot of trick nasana warriors coming up reach downward facing dog take your left leg up look underneath the left step forward guys all the way through reach in your quality lunge big one and step to your chair pose stay strong big sweep all the way straighten the body take it forward fold push step walk hop dandasana all the way come on up downward facing dog we're gonna look forward take your right leg up step forward again your lunge reach all the way up open it up warrior two hands but feet into the lunge top it back stay on your tippy toes at the back leg take it back all the way step to your chair pose big sweep keep on breathing all the way forward fold step walk up guys push down chaturanga we almost there almost there coming up downward facing dog take your left leg up look forward step forward reach to your lunge warrior two hands stay in your lunge top it back and back to the chair pose all the way sweep it all the way forward fold all right are you getting hotter dive down with me to chaturanga hold it keep on breathing keep on breathing breathe actively guys breathe actively do not quit look up all the way up dog downward facing dog take a look guys we're gonna go to the low chaturanga or the plank we're gonna kick our feet for eight times come on down plank or low plank and kick eight seven six five four kayla excellent job three guys two one up dog all the way transfer to the down dog take it back look forward bend those knees step walk or hop chair pose all the way hold the chair pose guys reach up and open reach up and open we're gonna grab our hands and create a lock fold forward through the hip flexors stay in your chair pose legs elbows all the way around the ears fierce pose keep on breathing 
Come on up from the chair pose to the back bend. We're going to release the hands behind and go to the full forward fold all the way. Drop the head, guys. Drop the head. Look halfway through. Bend those knees, step walk half. We're gonna go to chaturanga or plank, guys. We're gonna hit the eight kicks one more time. Come on, eight, seven, you can do it. Six, five, four, three. Power yoga today, two, one. Up dog, guys. Dumber face and dog, take it back. Excellent. Relax your neck, drop your hat. We're gonna move to the warrior flows, to the full warrior flow, which is gonna take us to the balance. Take, take the right leg up, look underneath the right. Find a lot of space in the hip, step forward. If you need to do two steps, do it. Guys, wide step on your mat. Take the hips all the way forward. Express through the pelvic floor, reach all the way up. Big breath. All the way, drop the shoulders, drop the shoulder blades towards the lower back, express through the heart. Those are weak arms, those are strong arms. That's it, warrior two. Keep your body level, take it back and just through the waistline, it doesn't have to be deep. That's good guys, keep on breathing. Take it all the way back to the warrior two, extend your front knee. Slide all the way through the side, hips towards the pots. Take your hand on the floor and reach up and open. Trikonasana or triangle, use your blocks if you do have them. We're going to progress into this flow in the second round, but right now just stay up here and gaze up towards the sky. Slowly fold forward back and square those hips. Make sure that you level and square those hips. Doesn't have to be low, but level your shoulders to the front of your mat. Side extended stretch. Slowly take your left hand on the floor or on the block. Reach up and open. That is good. Now stack your shoulders one on top of another. All of you doing great, guys. Rotate a little bit more through the waistline and hip flexor. Do not over rotate through the shoulder itself, right? Shoulder following that body. Take it back to the forward fold, side extended stretch. All the way, guys, all the way. Look up and forward. Shift the weight into the right leg. Take your time. We're going to the warrior three. Warrior three, not in your practice. You can take your arms on the side. You can have them on the floor, up front of the heart, or go all the way with me very good guys very good keep on breathing keep on practicing we're gonna do a powerful strong balanced transition come on up with me reach all the way grab your foot open it up take your time once we bring the left leg on the floor we're gonna go straight to the forward fold and hop back or step back Look halfway through, bend your knees, push down, chaturanga. It doesn't have to be a hop, come on up. Downward facing dog. Take your left leg up, guys, all the way. And step to the quality warrior one. Quality one. Square the hips, arms up, long, strong, all the way, long the ears. Big, powerful warrior one. We wrap her dress on the one, take it all the way to the second, look towards, gaze towards the front, in a light touch, light touch, that's it, come back to the front, palms up, extend your front knee, hips towards that side, towards the right, and slide all the way, slide, 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 slide to the waistline, settle down when you're ready, Continue, guys, soft, gentle rotation through the hips, pelvic floor in the lower back. Arm on top, just following. Come back to the center, to the side extended stretch. 
Lengthen in through the spine, guys. Keep your both knees long and extended. I know, keep your both knees long and extended. And slowly, revolve triangle. Right hand on the floor. Breathe actively. All the way, keep your revolve triangle. Just a few more breaths. And let's take it all the way to the front. Bend your front knee. Transfer the weight. We're ready for the warrior three. Your choice. It might not be there fully today. You might need to use the blocks, arms on the side, or take it all the way to the front. A lot of balance. From the warrior three in a few breaths, guys. We're going to make a smooth transition to the standing big toe hold. Take your time. Take your time. You're doing great. Great job, great job, great job, great job. Shoulders down. Breeze, guys. Breeze, 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 breeze. Slowly land that foot back straight to the forward fold. We're going to go to the low Chaturanga Dandasana, guys, or plank. Low Chaturanga Dandasana or plank. We're going to rock our heels side to side, either plank or Chaturanga. Come on down. Excellent. Keep the upper body strong, guys. Power yoga. Come on. Four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Come on up. Take it back to the downward facing dog. Proud of you guys. Come on. All the way. Drop the hat. Take your right leg up. Look underneath the right, then forward. Step forward to your warrior one. We back on the right leg on the warrior one. We're going to expand. You have a choice, guys, to do the same what we did. Or you have a choice to flow with me by lifting the heel of the ground. It's a strong variation of it. Do not fail the knees inward. Reach up and open. Longer arms, longer arms. Good, strong, long back. Warrior two. Excellent. Gaze forward, gaze forward. Both legs supporting the asana. Tap your back leg. You can always take your heel back, right? Give it a try, take it back. Back all the way. Extend. Place your both feet back on the floor. Triangle Trikonasana. All the way, dive from here. We're going to expand today. You don't have to do anything. You just can stay right where you are. It's already a lot of work. You can also take your hand all the way behind. All the way behind to the inner thigh. Continue to rotate up towards the sky. We're holding it for a few more breaths. Keep on breathing, guys. Only if you're ready. You have to be steady on both legs equally. Take your right arm forward. You see, you're practicing cute. Very good, very good, very good, guys. Stay strong on both legs. All the way back to the Trikonasana. Undo the hand and stay just in your triangle. Or go ahead and bind with me underneath. Continue to rotate your upper body towards the sky. And we go slowly back to the side extended stretch, guys. Square the hips, side extended stretch. We still have a revolve triangle left. Take your time, set your left hand on the floor. Little external rotation on the right. All the way. Big breaths. Beautiful, keep reaching, keep reaching. And draw your right hand all the way behind. Big press. Good work, guys. Good job. Melissa, take the chest up. Up, 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 up. That's it. Not down, guys. Come back. Square the hips. We're going back to the balance, guys. Back to the balance. Take your time. Warrior three. We're going to work in there a little bit. So take your time. Find the warrior three first. Today in the warrior three, we're going to take the foot up and flat, up and flat 
and we're gonna go for tiny little kicks few of them guys few of them straight to the sky elbows right along your ears two left one left coming up big toe guys take your time good job excellent good boy guys it doesn't have to be a straight leg doesn't have to be a straight leg we will slowly switch the hands it can be just a bend one or all the way extend very nice breathe 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 guys breathe i'll have to look at your progress take it back team all the way reach up and open all the way forward fold step walk or hop Stay in your plank or low chaturanga dandasana. We're gonna go ahead and top out the toes to the side. You can stay in your plank. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three guys. Two, one, up dog. Good job, come back. Proud of you guys. Take your left leg up. Step forward to the beautiful, strong warrior one. You can continue to be on a flat feet. You can lift your front heel. Take the chest up and forward, chest up and forward. Beautiful, keep on breathing, keep on breathing. Take it all the way to the warrior two. Level those arms. Gaze towards the front hand. Longer arms, guys, longer, stronger arms. Tap it back. and all the way back to the center extend both knees flat both hands flat both feet slide through hips to the right touch the floor progression isn't optional right just as we did on the other side give your body a little bit time take your arm all the way behind if you're ready all the way behind towards the inner side on the other side don't fail the chest guys don't drop the shoulders forward up and open everybody up and open only if you're ready we're gonna take the left hand off the ground use both legs both legs strong reach to the side reach to the side gaze forward that's it that's it Take it all the way back and undo the right arm. Stay with me for a couple more breaths or go all the way to the full bind in Trikonasana. Left underneath the left. Mm -hmm. Mindfully guys, mindfully. I know you're super strong and driven. Take it back to the side to the front side extended stretch all the way all the way here square the hips level the shoulders we're going for the revolve triangle through the center through the midline all the way Take it all the way to the center. Level your shoulders, guys. Take your time. We're gonna go to the warrior three and kicks, guys. Take your time, come on up. You can just decide to stay in the warrior three or have your hands on the floor. If you come in with me, we're gonna bring and lift that knee 90 degrees, kick. Seven, six, five, four, three two one guys slowly soft transition big toe big toe big toe that's it that's it breathe actively
Great job. Take your time when you do transition to the other side. Switch the hands. Gaze within, balances inside, not outside. Take your time, take your time. Ron, excellent, Kayla, great job, guys. Great work, guys, great work, guys. Take it all the way slowly back. We're gonna reach up. All the way forward fold, all the way. Look, halfway through, we're gonna step in the plank or chaturanga low. Push down. And we're ready for the rocking. We're gonna rock back. We take it front, maybe through the toes, maybe not. Stay in your plank, back, forward. You don't have to roll through the toes if it's not ready. And forward, guys. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Finish strong this one. Two, one, up dog. Nice and smooth. You can go right now to your cobra, supported dog or on your elbows. Go ahead and look behind one shoulder. And all the way above another. Take it back to the center and bring your right foot all the way at the back of the left knee. All the way, reach up and open. Tuck your toes, guys, on the left. And slowly shift it back. Square the shoulders, square the hips. Take it back to the up dog, support it or not. Support it or not, guys. Good job. Come on back. One more time. Support it or not support it. You don't have to go the full power. Take it back. We're going to shift to the side plank, guys. On the left. Beautiful. Take your time. Take your time. If you're ready, you don't have to. We're going to grab the big toe just like we did on our standing balance. Look at you. Keep on breathing, guys. Don't quit. Don't quit. Don't quit. Slowly take it back. Chaturanga of your choice. One legged one or both feet on the floor, knees on the floor. Power yoga, guys. You ask for it, you got it. Relax your neck all the way, guys. Look forward. Shift your back to the up dog or cobra. Shoulders up, back, and down. All the way. Look above one shoulder. It's like when my kids ask for some food. Mom, can I have a big smoothie? Yes. Mom, I don't want smoothie anymore. You ask for it, you eat it. <laughs> right? Oh, get it back all the way. Take your left all the way right above behind get ready take it back all the way doesn't have to be the full way you can have that knee on the floor and back all right one more And on the next one from the down dog, we're going to go to the plank, guys. On the right. Flow, team, flow. You can stay right there or grab your big toe. Stay with me. Breathe actively. Take it back through your choice of Chaturanga Dandasana. Your choice. Come on up. Down dog, guys. We're going to rest in the downward facing dog for eight to ten breaths. Bend your knees, lift your heels, rock your hips. Express through the back, draw the shoulder blades apart and wide. Practice wide, long, extended back, guys. All the way. Go ahead and look forward, bend your knees, hop step a little bit wider than the hips width apart. Mm -hmm. So first of all, we're going to strengthen the legs a little bit in a wider feet, chair pose, arms up front, chest up and open. Great work. 
Coming up on the tippy toes. Active legs, guys, active legs. Now go ahead and shift the weight on the left. On the left, take your hands on the floor and just shift the weight. Like your right toes just supporting. Do it to the other side. Now your left toes just supporting all the weight on the right. Shift it back. Go ahead and take your right arm. Sneak this under. See if you can bind. Right underneath the right, behind the back. I want you to do just a few. Stands up. Maybe it's not all the way through. You stand up. You take it back. You stand up. You take it back. Do at least two or three. Excellent. On the next one, we're going to come up and we're going to be here. If you can afford and take your wrist instead the hand, grab your left wrist. Grab your left wrist because it's going to be helpful later on when you need to extend your luck. Take your time and we don't have to go to the birds. Bird of paradise might be not there. Find the stand force. Keep on practicing, guys. I don't stand just doing nothing. Come on, Steven. Keep on practicing. When you're ready, give it a few tries, guys. I'm practicing with you. It's hard. Everything worthwhile. Take some work. Keep on trying. One more try. Come on, guys. One more try. Come on. You can do it. You're stronger than that. Strong people don't quit. One more try, everyone. Good job. Take it back, guys. Take it back. Full forward fold. Relax. Relax. Drop the head. Come on up on the tippy toes. Just rock. Take it back. Go on your heels. Rock on the tippy toes. Back on your heels. Beautiful. Now go ahead and lift your left heel. See if you can draw the left underneath the left and bind. We're going to give it a few dynamic stand up and taking it back. We're doing it to be very confident. So you're not just holding your breath and holding your balance by luck and accident. I want you to be confident in your balance. And that comes through the practice, through the movement. Come on up. We're going to hold it together. Just hold it. You don't have to extend that leg. Just hold it, guys. That's very good. Betty, great job. Great job, guys. Now, only if you're ready or give it a few kicks. That's it. That's it. Let's give it a couple more tries. It's a practice. That means it's a continuous process. Right? Come on. Keep on practicing. One more, everybody. Give it a one more strong try. If it's there, it's there. If it's not, it doesn't matter. You did your best. Take it back. Shake it out. Proud of you guys. Reach all the way. Fold forward. Take your hands on the floor. And walk a couple more steps. Coming up on the toes. Rock back on the heels. Go ahead, guys, and reach your right leg up. Right leg up. We're going to be floating in between Arha Chandrasana and low lunge. Knee on the floor or just a regular lunge, Anjaniyasana. Right hand up. Find the good quality stand in your Arha Chandrasana. Don't worry about the, how long can you stay there. Just be there with me. Slowly, guys. Soft rotation. Bend your left and glide. You can stand your right knee on the floor if you have to. All the way, reach up and open. Take your time. Find the balance. Take your hands. Float you are Hachindrasana. It can be the bound one, just like I'm doing. It can be the regular one. It can be both hands on the floor. Use your blocks. 
One more time, slow transition. Mindful to the lunge. You're doing best. Come on, guys. Come on, come on, come on. Find the balance. Arha Chandrasana of your choice. Excellent. Beautiful, guys. We're going to take and let that right leg go. Step all the way back behind the left. Mm -hmm. Hold your both hands on the floor. Hold your right foot on the outer edge. We're going to work the strings. Activate your inner thighs on the right and kick for a few times. Kick, kick, kick. Next one, when you land, look up and open towards the left. All the way, give it a good rotation, good opening in the hips. You will need it right now in a second. And now kick one more time and try to catch it up. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and squat with me. Baby grasshopper. Keep on breathing, keep on breathing, guys. Try to do your best, take a look. We come up, we reach. Take it back, we squat. Give it a couple tries. Coming up, find the balance, find the balance. Let me see you practicing. And one more time, baby grasshopper. And standing clock, come on. Push it. Excellent. Take it back all the way on the floor. Come on up. Reach. Draw your hands all the way behind. Little back bend. We're going to stand here for two, three breaths. Come on back up. Forward fold. Take your left leg off the floor, guys. Floating from Arha Chandrasana, half moon pose to the lunge pose. Open it up first. Find the balance. Tranquil within, guys. Slowly, hands on the floor, bend your right and glide. Doesn't have to be fast. Stay strong. To the lunge position, to the lunge. And slowly make your transfer back to our Hutch and Drasana of your choice. See if you can bind right away smoothly. Mm -hmm. That's very good. A lot of balance. Come back to your lunge. Mm -hmm. Watch your knees, guys. You crisscross them. It's going to be very unbalanced. One more time, everyone. Woo. All right. Go ahead and take release the left. Step all the way outside of the right. Both hands on the floor. We're going to be activating the inner thigh on the left. Mm -hmm. Kick it for the few times. Stay in the squat on the right. Kick. I know, kick, kick, keep your left hand on the floor, left foot on the outer edge, outer blade, open it up, open it up first, open it up first, now we're going to be kicking it up and picking it up, I'm going to wait for you all in the baby grasshopper. Baby sounds kind of like easy version of it. All right, come on up to the clock pose. Take your time, take it back. Let me see you practicing. Super strong, guys, super strong. I'm glad you're trying it. The most important thing that says you're trying. Come on up. Let me see you, let me see, lift, 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 lift that knee. Come on back up, last one, guys. 
proud of you, team. Come on, one more time. That's it, that's it, that's it. Let it go. Come on up and land with me all the way. All the way down. Come on down, come on down. Lift the heart all the way up. Little bit wider feet, guys. Come on up and open. We're gonna do our best, malasana toes, wide leg squat, in open seated upright angle pose. Your knees can be bent, take a look. We did before malasana, but we're gonna add up the toes if you can. You can start right now. Come on. A lot of control and a lot of core work here. It looks very easy when someone else does it, but it's a lot of core control. Reach up and all the way back. Come on up, come on up. You're doing awesome. One more time. Come on, guys. Don't slam the bottom. Try to lift and land it. Reach up, 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 up and open, up and open. One more time. Beautiful. One more time. We're gonna stay in a open, upright seated angle. All the way, all the way. We haven't practiced one arm boats for a long time and revolved one, so we're gonna do it today. Take the chest up and forward, up and forward. Stay with me, find the balance, find the balance. Shoulders down. Take the feet all the way. Grab your feet or toes with the left. It can be support, it can be that your legs bent. It looks much scarier than it is in person. Open it up. Very nice. Chest up, guys, chest up. Beautiful. Now you're going to let go of the left foot and continue to open. You're gonna bring your left all the way back and grab it. Just like we do our bow and arrow, right? But we're holding it in the air. Lift the heart up. Hold the balance, hold the balance, hold the balance. Just up. All the way back. Hold the balance, shoulders down, extend the knees if you can, bring the both legs together to the other side. Very nice. We're just going to give it a few breaths and then we're going to let go of the right leg. If you need to put it back on the floor, put it back on the floor. Switch and pick up, pick up your right, leave the heart, leave the heart, excellent, good work guys, take it all the way back, we're going to be working in between the boat pose and the open seated upright angle, together, Come on up, exhalation. Let me see you working, chest up. Commitment, guys, turn on your commitment button. It's a big red button inside, I can do it. The name on that button. Come on, all the way. Use a center, it's a lot of core strings. One more, come on down. All the way. I think you're doing so good so we can do one more. Hold it with me. From the center, guys, from the center. Everything is right here. Remember, scoop the belly, put the navel in, keep the abs strong. Don't overdo it. We're gonna bend the left. Try to hold that left ankle 90 degrees. I know it's hard. Lift the ankle, take it back. 
Stay with me, guys. All the way, feet nice and wide. Take the hands behind. Lift up and open. Upward, tabletop. Keep on breathing, guys. Few more breaths. We're going to bring it back. Put our feet regular place right underneath the hips. Back to the upward tabletop. You can stay on all four. That's totally fine. Bring the hips up. Bring the hips up, guys. Go ahead and take your right ankle right on top. Keep on breathing, guys. Keep on breathing. All the way, leg up. Beautiful form, a little bit higher, a little bit higher. Slowly take it back, bring it back. Take a breath or two, come on up. Left. Hips up, hips up. Breathe, breathe, breathe actively when you're ready. Use a hip string, use a hip strings. Take it back, excellent work guys. All the way slowly back on the floor. Legs up, towards the sky. We're gonna take the legs all the way up and open. Give it a good quality struggle, point the toes down and just hold it for the few breaths. We're ready to put our right knee above the left knee, just like we do our cow face pose on a seated position. Grab your ankles and press on top on the ankles. Shoulders on the floor. Keep on breathing, guys. Keep on breathing. Keep on pressing right on top on the ankles. Beautiful. Go ahead and undo the legs and switch. Left knee above the right knee. Just like we do our cow face pose, not an eagle pose. All the way, keep pressing on the ankle, shoulders on the floor. Few more breaths. Take it all the way back. Slowly put your both feet 90 degrees above the floor. Come on up with me and open. We just holding it for eight to 10 breaths. From the center guys, lower back grounded. From here guys, we're gonna just tap the floor with the toes. Nothing is changing in between your knee space. Your knees are staying super stable. You release it from the center of your body, from the center of your body, all the way from the center of your body. Excellent, couple more. Good job. Go ahead and bring those feet all the way up. Stay just where you are or come with me with a shoulder stand. We're going to be working in the shoulder stand. Your shoulder stand shouldn't involve any neck. If you just want to remain in the shoulder stand, remain just right there or go ahead and split and touch to one leg halasana. Take it back, split and touch, one leg halasana. Take it back. Split and touch. One leg halasana. Take it back. Split and touch. One leg halasana. Two more times. All the way one more time. Go ahead and bring both feet together.
slowly bring both knees back towards the forehead. Come on up and roll with me. We have a few more strong asanas here, but let's go for the forward fold first, just to release if there's any tension building your neck. On your shoulder stand, you never, ever, ever, ever want to feel the neck. Let's slowly bring the right foot closer, right up here. So if you're ready, we're gonna practice today's split as well. So at the very, very end, you can stay just where you are. You're doing so good with that. Draw the opposite hand. Remember, opposite is the easiest way. The opposite is the easy way. Surprisingly breezy today. Come on, come on, guys, keep on trying. You're doing great, guys, keep on trying. Keep on trying. Slowly go ahead and draw. We did start practice it. Come on, guys, come on, keep on trying. I know some of you already holding it underneath the elbow. It's a balance, it's a balance. You do this, your, your full grass grasshopper, it's on his way. Very good, Ron, good job. Come on back down, guys, come on back down. Move it, move it, move it. All right, left. Start simple, step by step, layer it up, layer it up, bring it a little bit more, give it a little bit more when you're ready. Start with the opposite. Start the opposite one. Perfect. Another beautiful day. Then two. Once you stable here, there is nothing changing, especially for those who already have that bind in the seated position. All you adding is it just more balance. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> All right, guys, keep on, keep on breathing, keep on breathing. It's just, it's just a practice. You guys can do it. It's just a matter of figure it out, combine, not to worry about the balance and get what you already been doing. Come on back. Take your legs all the way. Reach all the way forward, fold. We're going to prepare for that split. We're going to do pigeon. We haven't done pigeon for ages. So do your best. Take your right. Behind, take your left. And you can do your modified one or you can go ahead and just dive straight into the pigeon on the left. And then we're gonna switch the legs. Then we're gonna go for the splits after we do the pigeon on the both side. Do your pigeon slowly. Through the cow face pose, through the cow face pose, we already did it on the seated position. Give it a breath or two. Take your time. That's good. Shoulders down. Dive right into the hips, right into the hips. Mm-hmm. Go ahead and, pr and push your, bring your hands right on top on the ankles and just give it a few 
lifting up movements. That's very good. Just a couple more. Just the one more. Very nice. We're going to take and leave right up front. Takes the left into the pigeon pose. Mm -hmm. Take your time. Notice the differences right and left. And then slowly, guys, through the cow face pose. We're gonna move down to our splits. Find your cow face pose on the other side. Give it a few breaths just to settle down so there is no pain and aches in the knees. If there is, you have to move and readjust it. Knees, ankles, hips, pain are not acceptable in the yoga practice. Discomfort in challenge is great pain is not acceptable it's prudent to leave the asana please go ahead press into the ankles lift it for a couple times few times creating more space let's do just one more excellent go ahead and set the left up front Remember, let your knees to extend the last. Work on the hips. Just relax the hip flexor, bigger muscles in your legs, quadriceps, glute first, and then the knee, leaves the knee till the very last thing. Let's take our time for this split. It's hot, it's actually good for the splits. We did so many good things for it, so activate the ankles, the hips. So take your time. Once you feel you're ready, there is no more active room in the hips. Then go ahead and extend the front knee. One step at a time. Very good, guys. Keep on holding it. Split requires some hold. Split requires some hold. I know. I'm not showing off. All right. All right, guys. Let's take it all the way slow. Back and switch the legs. Again, split says that that one of the things like Virasana Hero Pose in Lotus. You have it once you practice it, you stop practicing it regularly, it's gonna go. For all of us. So we're gonna give it a good few deep inhalations, exhalations. Wait until your body will give you a green signal. We're just holding it for the few extra breaths, guys. Inhalation through the nose, exhalation to the places where it needs to go the most. I don't want you to hurt yourself, so don't push it through the pain, please. Because micro tears will happen, you won't notice it, but then it's going to be very, very challenging to practice all other asanas. Once you're ready, just give it a try. Roll your left knee under. Take your time, take your time. Melissa, you have to take the left knee under. That's it, I know. It looks deeper when you do rock on the side. It does look that you go deeper, but don't sacrifice the form for the depths. Couple more breaths, guys, don't quit. 
Let's go ahead and come out of it. Come on up to the front of your mat. Front of your mat. Virasana or hero pose. We will go ahead and rest up here in the hero pose for the hips or you can lay down into the full one. Just decide which one is in your practice. Maybe it's just the one which is a halfway through. Mm -hmm. If you guys can handle more of the hero pose, come on up with me back. We're going to fold forward. If you need to come out, just bring your feet up front. But it's going to decompress your back really, really good if you stay with me in the hero pose. And come on guys, up with me and find yourself in a simple tabletop. We're going to give it a few a hips rotation so that will decompress the back even more in the hips and the knees. Just a few soft rotation from the right to the left and then we will reverse it. And then just go ahead and reverse it to the opposite direction. It's such a simple movement, but that will give the back a lot of health. Soft, simple movements on the floor, supported one, can heal the back very quickly. And go ahead and just sit back on your heels, tuck your toes, and just press your toes into the floor. Come on back in the center and draw your left underneath the right and just give the shoulders good quality decompression. We don't have to lift the arms, just let the weight go on that left shoulder. And let's do that on the other side. And come on back up with me. Go ahead and take your knees, sit however is comfortable for you. We reach all the way up. Draw those arms up and open. Take them up front of your heart, guys. It's another precious, beautiful day and we're given everything we only need. We have our house, we can move, we can practice, we can breathe, we can enjoy the beautiful company of each other. And I'm so, so grateful for each and every one of you. So thank you so much for being here. And with that, let's again smile with our heart and make a commitment 
nights, rose a day, respond, not to react, no matter what comes across yourself. And let's spend this day with unshakable love and peace inside. Namaste.